A lot more fearsome than the stories, aren't they? Stay back, stranger. I will use this if I have to. It's not very friendly of you now, is it? Look, perhaps it's best you wander back down to your village. Leave the dragon slain to the professionals. I made a promise to the woman I love that I would retrieve a dragon egg. I may have also promised the king that I would slay the beast whilst I was at it. That was rather silly of you now, wasn't it? Yeah, well, I was incredibly drunk at the time. But that's no business of yours! <coughs> oh. ah. Ah. I know you. You're Dane Corhart. You were the king's dragon slayer. Not anymore. Pays better to be an outlaw. There's a hefty bounty on your head. Yep. Somehow, I doubt you'll be the one to claim it. Don't follow me. Wait! Wait! Let me come with you. <laughs> All I need is one dragon egg. What use would I possibly have for you? I can cook. Really? That's what you're leading with. Wait! I'm a bard! I can sing! That's how I was going to distract the dragon. I heard dragons love music. The dragons hate music. Even better. Please. I cannot return empty-handed. What's your name? Esga. You're desperate, Esga. I find that amusing. All right, so how about this? You go in first, and you sing to the dragon. Hmm? I'll go around the back, and I'll kill it. You're still alive at the end of this whole ordeal? I'll give you a dragon egg. Smallest one, of course. I suppose that's fair. Lead the way.